Welcome to Room 6, the channel dedicated to the local music scene and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and we're back with another singer-songwriter showcase hosted by Hal Savar at Soul Belly Barbecue on Main Street in downtown Las Vegas. This venue is awesome, and the community Hal's been building is really amazing in both its talent and supportiveness of each other. This time, we have some old friends, some new friends, and a whole lot of Room 6 alumni, both past and future. Now then, on to the review! And did I mention? They even let me play sometimes. Don't worry, I brought earplugs for everyone. This weekly event happens every Sunday at 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time and is live streamed by yours truly right here on the channel. I put the link to this video's corresponding live stream down in the description for you to check out when you're done here. If you'd like to be featured on the showcase, hit up House of R using his social media handle that I've put down there as well. That's also where you can find out how to follow all the featured performers in this week's performance review. If you'd like to be on the channel for an interview, review, or both, hit me up using my email address or Room 6 social media link down there. And uh, that link is also where you can support the channel on Patreon, my online merch shop, Room6.shop, and more. Kicking things off as usual was our host, Hal Savar. Hal's known around town as a human jukebox, thanks to his prodigious performance of other people's music. Joining Hal on stage was Amati the drummer, who sat in with whoever wanted him throughout the night. The duo did one song to break the ice, but this would not be the last we'd see of them. Following Hal was a new showcase guest, but an old friend of Hal Savar's in the form of Michael Spadoni. Playing keyboard inverted style, Michael went from soulful to playful with his set, showing a range of songwriting talent. I hope to get him on the channel someday soon. Another new face to the showcase was next. This time, we were treated to music by Chris Mendoza. Combining walking chord progressions with clever lyrics, Chris did a great job introducing himself to everyone, and I look forward to hearing more from him. Back for another shot at the spotlight was Nicholas Morgan, a songwriter making waves on the local scene. Blending blues sensibilities, reminiscent of John Mayer with bursts of guitar brilliance a la Blues Saraceno, Nicholas was awesome and the crowd was appreciative. Making his triumphant return for a second go-round, Dennis Blair was next. Denny likes to inject comedy into his music sometimes, and with an upbeat little song called I Hate Everybody, this time was no different. Big mood, Denny. Big mood. Switching gears, he then regaled everyone with a tearjerker straight out of Nashville and an Irish jig-inspired ditty. Either way, you owe it to yourself to catch him live if you can. Direct from the Smith Center, Norman Kim was back to light up the stage. Two words come to mind when Norman performs. Powerful and passion. His natural vibrato resonated with the emotions evoked by his lyrics, and the bar for performing definitely went up. Fortunately, the next act was Hal and Amante, and they were up to the challenge. Upbeat and catchy, Hal's music is always a treat and great for taking things up to another level. This time was more of the same, and they set the stage perfectly for the next act. That next act was, soon to be interview guest, David Wax. Like usual, David put on a clinic in power ballad writing with hints of Elvis Costello and other talented musicians coming through. I can't wait to get him on the channel soon, and uh, I think you'll enjoy it as well. Up next for his second time ever at the showcase was TJ Lavin. TJ has a nice ability to blend rapid fire lyrics with acoustic and folk vibes to create a solid and unique sound that the crowd enjoyed thoroughly. Following TJ was showcase favorite Aubrey Digital. Playing songs from her album Hello World, which I've reviewed on this channel, Aubrey's set was full of clever wordplay and moments of technical guitar playing, highlighting her pure and unadulterated talent, and I'm proud to call her a Room 6 alumni and a friend. Finishing out the night was our host, and Hal and Amante ended things on a decided, powerful high note. If you get the chance to see Hal play live, take it. Overall, this week's songwriter showcase at Soul Belly Barbecue on Main Street was a great one. Swing by next Sunday if you're in the area, or jump on the live stream at 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Love to have you, and we'll see you there. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope that you will swing by Soul Belly Barbecue on Main Street if you're in the area, or jump on the live stream next Sunday at 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Either way, go ahead and subscribe and ring the bell so that you are kept abreast of any new developments, or, you know, new videos. Other than that, if you want to see more videos like this, please click up here. Really, really appreciate you watching. Appreciate all of you who subscribe. And uh, yeah, remember to be amazing. And we will see you next time on Room 6.